Hi everyone, welcome to the channel and my name is Manish Tiwari. So in this particular video, we are going to talk about one of the important questions which comes from the Docker, whether you can delete your image from which your container is running or not. And what will happen to your container if you delete the image in between? So for the same question, we are going to cover the demo and we will see what will happen and how the things will behave. So let's directly move to uh, this AWS EC2 console, what I have already opened. And uh, I have already installed the Docker as well so that uh, we can do the demo. So let me uh, run the command to uh, pull nginx image. So Docker pull. And then we'll be running this nginx image. Okay. So it's pulling the image from the Docker hub. And uh, then we will run the container uh, out of this image. And we will see uh, how it behaves when we will try to delete this. So image has been uh, fetched locally and uh, like it's uh, available on the EC2 instance. If I do Docker images, you will see that Docker image, uh, this Nginx image is there on the system. Now, if I run Docker uh, and then uh, run, uh, then hyphen D to run your uh, image in the, like the container in the background, Docker run hyphen D. And then you pass the hyphen hyphen name and the name of the container we are going to give the as a demo. Then what you need to pass, you need to pass the image name from which your uh, container will run, application will run. So we have just enabled it. Now, if you see docker ps a, you will see one container ID is run. That means one container is running. It's up. It was created five seconds ago and the status is up. Even if you want to do docker container and ls, you will see container is, uh, ID is there. It's uh, up from 17 seconds. Correct. Now, if I want to delete the image, correct. So what I will do, docker rmi to remove your image. And then I will be passing the docker image ID. Sorry, the nginx image ID, correct. So let me just copy this image, copy. And then let's paste over here, docker rmi and the image ID. What does it say? Unable to delete this particular uh, image cannot be forced images being used by running containers. So even if you want to uh, do the force, correct? It won't allow you. Let me try that as well. Docker RMI hyphen F. Unable to delete cannot be forced. So if you want to delete your image, which uh, out of which a container is running and you want to delete that image from image ID, it will not be able to delete whether the container is running or uh, like the moment container is running, correct? So what will happen if I want to really delete it? So what I will have to do, docker, container, stop, and the uh, ID of the container, correct? So let me just select this container ID, copy, and then here you do con uh, paste. Your container has been stopped. So if I do docker ps a, you will see that it uh, what created, it, uh, it it has ejected four seconds ago. Now, if I want to delete the same uh, image, docker rmi hyphen f, or let's do without uh, hyphen f, that means without any forcefully, we want to delete, just, delete this, uh, this image. So it says that you cannot delete this without forcing. So it must be forced the container is stopped, then you can force uh, remove this particular image forcefully. So let me try docker rmi hyphen f and you are able to delete. It's untagged, it's delete. If I now do docker images, you will see there is no image. If I do the docker uh, ps hyphen a, you will see the container id is there and it, is, it has exited. If I do the docker container ls, you will see the container uh, is not running, it has exited, correct? So now, if I want to restart, what will happen? Let's see, docker container, sorry, docker container, restart. And then uh, the ID of the container. So where it is, this is the container ID. Let me copy and then let's paste over here. Uh, sorry, I will have to do this way. Mm, let me just remove. Once again, let me copy this. Copy. Then I have to paste it over here. So I will just paste. Let's see whether our container is running or not. Docker ps a It's up for four seconds. So it is stored locally. You can restart your container once again, even if image is no more. 
the same container can be restarted correct so if i do the docker container ls you will see it's up for 20 seconds and the container id is here so when we tried to delete the image while container was running we were not able to delete the image from its image id so what we did we stopped the container then we tried to delete without forcefully it was not like it didn't allow us to delete then we uh, use this hyphen f to remove the image forcefully then we were able to delete the image correct then if you want to restart your container you can restart as you can see here it's uh, up for the 20 second now if i want to do the second kind of scenario where i want to remove the image uh, forcefully even without stopping the container what will i do let's do docker images we do not have image now we have docker uh, uh, like we have this uh, container running let me uh, just stop the container and remove the container once again we will go from the scratch so docker stop and the id of your container correct let me do this copy docker stop and before that i need to mark this as a container container stop and then i need to paste the id of the container okay so the spelling mistake is there docker container stop correct then docker rm and then uh yes docker rm and then uh just let's paste the id removed if i do the docker ps a you won't see anything if i do docker images you won't see anything now let's move uh let uh, refresh this uh, docker pool nginx once again it will pull we will try the another way of uh, deleting your images correct and then we will try to remove your image forcefully when uh, your container is actually running in the previous example when we are doing we cannot delete the image while my container was running now we will try to do the same so docker run and before that let's do the docker images you will see one image is there now let's create the container docker run hyphen d hyphen f and name and once again we are going uh, to keep the same name uh, demo and then we will pass the name of the image one container is running once again docker ps hyphen a you can see it's running now if i want to let's do the docker container ls as well you can see if i want to remove this image what i can do docker rm i and the name of the image nginx unable to remove repository nginx must force so i will do hyphen f after this you can see it's removed so what has happened here let's do the docker images once again the repository has been untapped the image is not deleted yet in previous example when we were when we were trying to delete the image we used the image id and at that moment we were not able to forcefully uh, remain even the forcefully we were not able to remove the image we had to stop the container and then we were able to remove the image here my container is still running if you see the docker container ls your container is still running up about a minute ago but your image has been untagged that means the bridge or the link from your repository to the image which has been stored locally has been broken now so this repository is none earlier it was not none earlier if you see the uh, in the repository there was nginx correct whenever we have done this docker images you should see uh, the docker images where we do have a uh, docker image you will see the repository as nginx correct now if you see docker uh, repository is none so the link has been broken between this so that way you can forcefully untag this uh, image which is stored locally but you cannot delete if you want to really delete your image you will have to stop your container first and then you will be able to uh, forcefully remove the image from your local system so this way you can answer to your question and uh, this is the actual answer whether you can delete the image from which container is running or not or if you uh, delete the image what will happen to your actual container which is running so this is what i wanted to talk about in this particular video we will meet in the next video till the time thank you